today I've been doing too much, but as long as I have a good energy for today, then I'm good. I just drank an energy drink, right? And I apologize for any background noise that you guys might be hearing. I'm in my house, and you know I'm Mexican, y'all already know. Okay, anyways, so I think this is about like the second video that I'm gonna be filming right after I just uploaded one because I'm just kind of in the I'm kind of in the zone, you know. Just drink one of these. By the way, I got sponsored by Rockstar, which was an awesome accomplishment. Well, it's not. I don't know. That was an amazing opportunity that I was given. So Rockstar, thank you very much. That was for a TikTok video. I've also been writing in my success journal, and y'all, I get my stuff done real quick. Let me show you. I get stuff done. I get stuff done. This is how the pages look like. So if you guys want to get a hold of these, I highly recommend. A lot of my business friends are using it too and we all love it. I'm going to leave the link for you guys because I highly encourage you guys to get one of these. If you guys like just want to thrive and you guys want that business owner aesthetic, what you need as a business owner is definitely a journal that's going to keep you on the go. It's going to keep you in the zone. That rhymed. Anyways, we're going to start off this video with a lot of really good energy because I'm feeling it because obviously I'm feeling it and I'm like all over the place. Place with my mind and stuff so today's video is going to be I'm gonna look at the lens sorry so today's video is gonna be basically how to ship with shippo I need to get orders done done um, processing days have only been like two days like two to three days right now and I have been getting stuff done a lot more I've been getting stuff done a lot faster sorry with shippo and Shippo has been an incredible lifesaver and it, I'm just, I'm a little disappointed in myself that it took me this long to go from pirate ship to Shippo because you girl didn't really bother like, I was like intimidated by it, I don't know why. But I do recommend, um, if you guys have Wix and you guys are like kind of confused about like creating your labels and like who to go to, I highly recommend do not, and I repeat, do not purchase your labels for your orders directly from Wix. It's going to be a lot more pricey. It's going to be a little bit like, it's expensive. You 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 want to save money. And at first I was using PirateShip.com. I've always used it since like day one. Um, discounted shipping labels. I still use Pirate Ship, don't get me wrong. Like whenever I need to fix someone's orders manually, I will go to PirateShip.com to do so. Um, but that, I think that's like for another video. I don't want to go on ranting too much because I find myself doing that a lot and the editing process would be a lot easier if I just cut to the chase so you can connect Shippo to Wix or Shopify if you have a Shopify for if you have Shopify for your website that's great Wix that's also great um, but it works for both but sadly Pirate Ship does not work with Wix um, with Shippo you get things done a lot faster it's cheap um, the only thing is that it's only going to deduct five cents from every label that you purchase, which is like fine. That's like nothing. I remember it took me a long time when I used Pirate Ship, so Shippo is a lifesaver. And I'm going to teach you guys how to do it and how to kind of set it up because it's a little confusing. But I did reach out to a representative that helped me, which was great. I'm going to eat my salad very quickly and we ran out of chicken, so we're using chicken nuggets as a substitute. We're trying to get that summer bod because your girl, she gained a little bit of weight over quarantine. But you know what? That's okay. I still love myself. That's fine. That's what matters. Anyways, before we actually get started, please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. I hope you guys enjoy the video. In my office. So I usually keep a just a basic notebook. I don't really need anything too fancy. Um, I have my notebook, my binder my macbook with an additional adapter that gives me availabilities for usbs the charger and an sd card which helps a lot when editing my youtube videos this notebook the basic one is basically um whenever someone emails me saying that they made a mistake with their address or just like anything to do with an order i always write it down within this notebook because i don't like mixing everything up I like to put them down in one place where I can visually see what I need to get done, what order needs help, what order needs to be like sent out, which one was updated to be sent back as a return due to insufficient addresses. Um, so far, I'm not really going to show, but um, an order from Saudi Arabia because um, this person uh, didn't provide the full address information. That's why it wasn't letting me create the shipping label. So I'm glad this person reached out to me because I tried um, to reach out to this person 
and it's been a month and finally got back to me and I'm able to like ship out their order again. So now I'm just gonna open my dashboard, my Wix dashboard and Shippo. So I'm gonna quickly show you guys how I access Shippo. Um, before I start taking things out and start setting up everything I need to like start shipping out orders. Let me just... I probably should have gotten post-it notes just to cover it up. Okay, so this is basically how I access Shippo. I go over to my apps. And then, sorry if the lighting gets all wonky. And here, these are my apps that I have installed and connected with my domain. And here's Shippo. I just open it. And then to avoid while seeing everybody else's addresses, I'm going to just quickly turn away the camera. It does show the addresses, so let me go get post-its. I'll be right back. So this is how the homepage looks like. So here in Shippo, it'll show the customer's name and the address and here the order number. And then what I really love about Shippo is when you hover over the items, it'll tell you what they ordered. Um, most of these are just these three. Those are digital products, so I always ignore those. But this is a physical product, so all I'm going to package is that physical product, the Adorar Lip Gloss. Good taste, good taste. And I always go to Unfulfilled because obviously those are the ones I need to get done. And I always add a filter to enter the date, the start date and the end date for which packages I want to order from, like, starting. You guys get it, yeah. But it's really important by the time you get Shippo. Shippo is free. So you just go over to settings. I want to make sure you guys can see. Ignore the plain background noise. But um, you want to make sure you fill out all of this information. Like for example, um, that's pretty like easy. It's just like your addresses and stuff. But packages, that's like super important. We're just going to get rid of this. Okay, so here, these are package templates. Um, I gave myself a variety of options for like what I need to do. Like what every package, like the package type, the package weight. So I give myself a variety of options to match with that person's order. So for example, BM would be like bubble mailer. The, you, don't got, you guys don't have to copy this. This is just how I understand it and how I interpret it. So bubble mailer, like for example, if someone just ordered one lip gloss, it would be like damn near like two ounces. If someone ordered two lip glosses and I'm going to package it with a bubble mailer, I put in the dimensions, that would be like 3.22 ounces. Like you guys get the gist, right? And then PM is poly mailer, like just in case someone wants to order like a palette. Um, the boxes, if someone buys jumbo lip glosses, that's already like set out for me. And then you want to make sure that the default weight is like ounces and the distance unit is in inches. Um, but yeah, you can continue adding new templates. So let's go back. This is an example. Um, let's go back to orders. I'm going to just cover this up real quick so no one sees anything. So... Everything is automatically set at one lip gloss, but that is why the day the night before I package orders I always prep them. I didn't do that last night, but I'm gonna do it right now because for like the sole purpose of this video so obviously four items there's only one physical product one lip gloss is 1.90 ounces save an Audacity bundle comes with three lip glosses, so I go down to the templates that I provided, hit three lip glosses, 4.44 ounces, and save, and then it's already set. All I have to do is ship, sorry, not ship, package 25 orders at a time, buy those 25 labels, print it out, and then that's it. It is pretty self-explanatory. If you guys want a more detailed um, tutorial about how to set up, a Shippo account. Um, Shippo, if you're seeing this, sponsor me. But um, I would totally do so. Just let me know down in the comments if you guys want me to. Um, but I'm just going to show you guys how I go about it because you guys have seen the process of what it's like to package my orders like through Pirate Ship. But now that I have Shippo, it's a lot faster, a lot more convenient. So like I've showed you guys beforehand, I'm going to review all the unfulfilled um, packages, the orders, and I'm gonna start 
prepping the package information so that way I can just like start immediately um but yeah let me just figure out how many orders I'm going to do today and then I need to do some other stuff and maybe I'll include it in this video but give me like a few minutes a few minutes that's all it takes um I'm gonna time myself really quickly by the way you guys this is my new business phone if you guys do want to text me um and want to join the list of updates where like a new drop comes something like restocks or simply when another youtube video anything at all or you just want to text me and i have time to reply text me i'm gonna put the number right here but you want to text audacity to this number okay it's been like five minutes and i literally just finished prepping it i think i'm only gonna do 20 packages just for this video um just because I know I know myself so well I'm gonna be ranting pretty much a lot and that's gonna be a lot of editing for me so I just want to get straight to the point it's one of those days that energy drink got me like woo, crunch time you know so now I'm gonna show you guys how I set up some hand sanitizer clearing my desk area and everything I'm gonna zoom this out a little bit just so you guys have a bigger visual of what I'm doing maybe if I go like here okay I zoomed you guys out a little bit I have a lot going on here, so I'm just going to put my binder stuff over there. I always keep my thermal printer in its box. I have some labels there. Also, you guys, you guys can get like 6,000 of these for free with UPS. And I always put it right here, like right at the very corner of my desk, just so it's out of the way, but it's still convenient for me because I'm going to have everything already set up my foot fell asleep it's doing the most oh my gosh because i kind of like i memorized literally all the ounces per product so like in a way i'm like calculating it in my head if any other business owner is watching this please let me know if you can relate then i just attach it to my computer i don't use my windows laptop anymore because I finally figured out that glitch um, as to like why the Rolo wasn't printing through my MacBook. It's printing now and that's good. Um, I don't know what I'm going to do with that. I don't know if I should sell it or not. It still works pretty great. I could just give it to my little brother when he's older. I don't know. So then I just connect. So the way I would usually do it, I would just grab all of these bubble mailers set it out right in front of me grab my sharpie and just start writing down all the names in order in which it's listed so for example who's the first person on my list pamela is the first one on my list so i'm gonna go from pamela i start from the bottom of the page and work my way up on the page on my computer so i just where's my sharpie not me being lost in my own office because I use Sharpie so much, literally the ink is running out. And I'm too easy to go to my car because I know I remember I left a Sharpie in there. But. Oh my god. It's literally. It's literally running out. Maybe the other side? Oh. Well, this one works. Lily. Oh, she lives in Oakland though. Period. Because I'm in the Bay Area, so. Um. Andrea, Serena, and then I would just keep going. I do, it's like kind of funny because every single time when I fulfill orders, I can sometimes recognize my customers' um, names. I gotta love my returning customers, literally, they're like, they're the G's. So I'm only gonna do a couple. I love how I'm just like, Continuously looking at the screen. I'm just like writing without really looking. I trust myself. See the names come out the same when I'm not looking um, I got a lot of orders from California and lately I've been noticing that I've been growing locally as well I'm trying to get into pop-ups since um, things have gotten better where I'm from a few more packages I keep a really big box under my table with all the bubble mailers so that way I don't have to like walk across the room and Okay, so I think I'm only gonna do those. That's the pile. So these that's what I'm gonna be fulfilling in this video. Um, ooh, because I don't wanna make a I don't wanna make a big mess. 
so actually i'm gonna improvise a little bit i'm going to buy actually no i have to be honest i don't want to try any new things because i want to show you guys the process that i do it from okay so um since i worked my way up with the page where i'm going to work my way down because from the top of the page it's janice so i almost hesitated a little bit i apologize so now i'm gonna grab everything i need for packaging i still have a lot of these left over so i'm kind of like waiting for these to run out so i can um buy my new thank you cards because i rebranded like the color or like the scheme of my entire business um another thing that's new with my business as far as packaging goes i love like the whole packaging stuff so i have like free little okay so these are little little freebies free stickers for the orders and then my business cards i'm actually proud of myself as far as like restocking i made a lot i made like double the amount i normally would um so i don't have to worry about the next batch for the next month i don't know where that energy came from that day I just made all those lip glosses and stuff. So pretty self-explanatory. Make sure that I'm showing the process. So Janice. There's a lot. Okay. I thought our lip gloss is my best selling item. Not me making one that all fall right now. Come on now. Um I posted a video about it on TikTok and it got over a million views. And the demand for it has been super high. Something I really love about this lip gloss is because all of my glosses are super freaking hydrating. I'm not even kidding. I might be the business owner, but I'm really, really proud of my formula and my product. And I've been using it up all the time. I love my product so much that I literally keep taking from my inventory to have for myself. And I have like, like three of each in my room. Um, Janice ordered one Adorar lip gloss. I include all her freebies. Close it up and then I set it aside. I have like a really big mirror right here. Let me show you. I just set it right there. Keep it right there. You're doing the same thing over and over, but after every single one that I pack, sorry, I'm stuttering, that I package, I check it. So like I select it and then keep going. So by the time I'm done, there everything that I packaged will already be selected. Then I click buy. Like, for example, like, let's say I do 20, buy 20 labels, buy them, start sticking them on. Um, so, yeah. So, now I'm going to time lapse it. So, enjoy. haven't had a pretty big order in a while it makes me really happy that to find people that they really love my products i appreciate everyone's order so much i'm not sure if cassie's order is gonna fit in this i feel like i should just put it in a box i actually want to show you guys a hack when it comes down to usps boxes so usps boxes you can actually get for free but obviously, it, the shipping label costs more. I'm going to show you guys a way where you guys won't get charged as much when it comes down to these boxes. What I like to do is put the USPS boxes in big poly mailers. Because 
um, I, I forgot the what it's called. There's a term for it. But it'll be weighed and charged the same way as it would be if you were using a bubble mailer or a poly mailer. So you can, if you ship a box inside a poly mailer, it's cheaper. And they're not gonna know it's a USPS box inside the poly mailer and I got this for free so that's even more like money saving wise. So I'm gonna add some confetti in there just to keep things secure. Just add like two. So I'm not really talking about my products that much in my video so I think I should do so because she kind of got a little bit of everything the kiss me again lip gloss this was from valentine's day i think i made a little bit too much of these because it was literally just supposed to be sold during the month but i think i made a little bit too much of this so she's gonna be around for a while but it's black cherry scented and it smells really good we have the five dollar lip mask sorry lip mask lip scrub i'm like in the process of restocking my lip mask so i'm also thinking about that but it's really exfoliating Feels really good on your lips. We have the Peligrosa lip gloss. Black cherry scented. Has roses. It's rose infused with some gold flakes. We have the liquid lipstick. The one that I'm wearing right now. We have two Heine lashes. Gorgeous. Put that in there. I already showed you guys the palette. But she ordered a palette. And this palette was a collaboration with Venus Beauty Shop. And we can't forget about the Audacity Bundle. One with the CEO Lip Gloss, Adorar Lip Gloss, and Passionate Lip Gloss. Passionate Fruit Scented, Butter Vanilla Scented, and Dragon Fruit Scented. I am in the process of releasing more. Like, more lip glosses. It's just been a little bit harder. Because I've been growing and I, I find myself restocking a lot. Hope that my content inspires you guys. For those of you who aspire to be a business owner one day, I really hope that my journey kind of inspires you and I hope that what I'm showing you teaches you something. Um, I also don't wanna half-ass this video. Like I actually wanna give you guys good content. Um, but yeah, these ones are a little bit tight so I kind of have to like work it down the edges just so the bag itself will not rip. And these little awkward corners I like to tape down. Ooh, that was an annoying noise. That was annoying. Tape. Tape. I always like taking one of my stickers that say Audacity on it. Um, I think these are really cute too. So, And you guys get these for free with um, in every order. I like putting it in the corner. Period. I'm going to buy the labels now. Now I'm going to show you guys what it looks like. Hold on. Look at all this mess that I made. It's okay. It's an easy cleanup. But one of them were international. 19 of them were domestic. $80.22 is going to be my total. I'm going to confirm my purchase. The printer is already on. Ready to go. Um... It's loading, it's loading, it's loading, it's loading. And that's perfect. All 20 labels have been purchased. That's what I like to see because sometimes um, one of them won't purchase because either there's some missing, like some invalid information or um, Shippo is not able to recognize the address. Okay, so now I'm just gonna hit print. This process is pretty fast, so I'm just gonna cover it while it prints. Ah, don't look. Just admire my nails. No. Per. And my favorite process of it all is to get on the ground and just start Sticking them on. And like I've always said before, the labels print out in the same order that they were packaged. Don't mind my Crocs. Um, but this is what I'm working with right now. I I can only see the first name, so as long as they match, then we're good. <gasps> so, the name that I'm looking at here is Pamela. So, we're gonna 
work our way up. Yeah. In order. This is like the fastest way I do it. Honestly, I really don't know if other business owners do it this way. But now that I've gone with Shippo instead of Pirate Ship, I find myself getting packages done a lot quicker, a lot more efficiently, and my customers are happy with it. The fact that they are coming sooner than expected and they don't have to wait that long is great. And I just keep going. And with Shippo, I learned that with Shippo, I learned that the confirmation emails would be sent three hours after um, their labels were created, which I actually have no problem with. Um, I, like I really don't mind it because that's like the whole point of the growing process in business. You have to identify what works for you and what doesn't. Porque lo que pasó, pasó. Like, what happens, happens. And things go from one way to another and you end up doing you. Fun. But yeah. Been getting a lot done and now I'm done with these and then I'm going to ship these out tomorrow. I know that I could just have someone pick it up, but I'd feel a lot more secure if I took them down myself. And I recently, today, I just got myself a P.O. box. And actually, this is an amazing time to tell you guys. Let me zoom in real quick because I'm getting really serious. Basically, I got myself a P.O. box. I don't feel like this angle is pretty flattering. Hold on. The sliding. We stand for it. Um, I just got myself a P.O. box. Uh, I remember doing one of like my very first videos you guys requested i do like a small business promo video where like i'm shouting out different small businesses and i had people send me their products so i can like help support because i love giving back oh i solely got a p.o box just for that since ever i love going to like la pulga the flea market i love going to i, I just like seeing pop-ups booths of small businesses and i love purchasing from them feel that having people send in their stuff for me to show and like showcase on my channel would be a really great space for others to like kind of expand their flavors a little bit see what they like and give people a chance to really grow because I struggled a lot believe it or not like everyone has their own struggles when trying to grow on social media it's like business wise and I just feel like it's like doing this would be a really great opportunity so i'm gonna leave my p.o box information on the screen and in the description box um on the in the description right now i'm like not thinking about it right but by the time this video is finished and edited um i'm gonna have a lot more information so just please read all the information um down below in the description box if you guys are interested in sending in your products for me to review and like show on my youtube channel um just read all the information down in the description box. There's going to be a deadline for you to send in your products. I'm going to be going to my P.O. box like every single day. Just checking if something came in or not. All rules, requirements, and deadline will be linked below. I'm just on my floor. Zoom. But as always, thank you guys so much for watching my YouTube content. My YouTube video. My watching like my whole journey actually please let me know down in the comments what you guys would like to see i'm planning on releasing that how to build a website video super soon um it's just like a lot of editing because i'm like showing my screen and myself at the same time and i'm still trying to figure that out don't forget to like comment and subscribe i love you guys so much you guys mean the world i literally would not be here right now doing what i do following my passion, chasing my dreams, if it weren't for you guys and your support and everything. Everyone has a good morning, good afternoon, and a good night from wherever you are in the world. Bye, chicas.